How y'all? How y'all doing? I hope you're having a great day. I hope your day has reached its optimum level of peakness. And you know I hope that for you. But if you're saying, well, it just isn't quite there yet, keep on pushing. It'll get there, I guarantee you. Well, today in this booze and kitchen, and you know I'm Sheila, Sheila Edwards. Today in this booze and food kitchen, we're going to be cooking beer battered fish. Yes, and I love a good piece of fish, but I love it even better when it's a little boozy. So let's get on over the counter and get the batter put together for this fish, get it fried up, and we'll be eating in no time. See you on the counter. We're getting the batter together for our um, fish. So here in this bowl, I've already sifted a cup and a half of all-purpose flour. To this, I'm adding two tablespoons of salt. Just regular, not tablespoons, I'm sorry, teaspoons. Two teaspoons of salt. And I'm gonna add a teaspoon of black pepper, just seasoning up the uh, flour here for this batter. And I'm gonna do um, a teaspoon and a half of garlic. This is just garlic pepper, okay? So then I'm gonna kinda move this around a little bit in this uh, flour. And now I'm going to add uh, this is 12 ounces of beer, and this is a, a, a stout, uh, beer extra stout actually. This uh, Genesis extra stout right here. So that's what I'm using in this uh, beer batter. And it's going to kind of gradually get that moved in there until it's all incorporated. And it's going to be kind of a thin batter. Yes, this is not your clear beer. This uh, Genesis is more of a brown uh, beer, but I'm told it has a, a good taste to it. Uh, just any beer that you have actually will do the trick here. You just want some beer in that bag, okay? So we're gonna get this all mixed up, and then we'll be ready to drop our fish, coat our fish in this batter, and then get it ready for the hot oil. I can smell it beer. So this is basically what it's looking like. See how thin that is? That's all we want. So we have a few things going on here. We have our beautiful fish here. We have our oil heating up at 375 uh, degree temperature. Our beer batter is here ready. We have the flour that we're gonna dredge our uh, fish in before it goes into this hot oil. So I'm using this cod. I hope you can see these beautiful pieces of cod right here that we're using uh, for this recipe. So I'm gonna take each of them out. There are, I'll have them resting already on a paper towel. I just wanna make sure that they're good and, I'm sorry, I just wanna make sure that they're good and dry. And then I'm gonna put a little salt and pepper on each of them, salt so, uh, front and back. Them dry a little bit and I'm gonna get a couple of pieces in there and I'm gonna continue on well just three pieces in there and then I'll continue on with this process okay so pepper each one the salt both sides pepper salt okay now we're gonna take them put it into my batter keep one hand clean and some people do this with tongs but I just don't mind using my hand I hope you can see me dredging this in here right here okay and then I mean uh, coating it in there and then put it into this flour Hope you can see me just 
I'm just basically turning it over in this flour and then I'll put it into this bowl. See? You see that? Oh, back just a little bit, okay? And I'm just gonna continue with this. Actually, I think I'm gonna get some uh-huh. Yeah, that's getting a little a little thick in there. I don't want it to be such a mess for my hands to <laughs> see how thick that gets there. I'm gonna turn this over. Yep. And then I'll get it into the flour. I'm gonna get in the flour whole thing. You see? Get it in the flour. And then Okay. And get it into that oil. And this all goes in about five minutes. And I'll continue to do this until I get all pieces into that oil. The beer batter thick is frying up beautifully. Let me see. See how beautiful that is? You see? Yes. Beautiful. I'm gonna let this go just a little bit more. There we go. And these two. Yes. Very nice. We're gonna go on and remove Woo! this uh, beer batter. This is something beautiful. Y'all, look at that. Look, let me bring this a little closer. Look at that. Now, it almost looks like chicken, huh? And I'm gonna put my last two pieces in here. And make sure you, you got you some a sink nearby because this is a, a kind of a a messy uh, process. Look at my fingers, you see? <laughs> yes, but you know, it's worth it. In the end, you get to eat uh, this uh, wonderful fish. I'm gonna, this wonderful fish. So, put that in there. And when that browns, look at that. When that browns on both sides, we're gonna be ready to eat. Look how beautiful that is. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Look. Look how beautiful that is. And listen to that sound. Isn't that something how food just ignites all of your five senses? You can see it, you can hear it, you can smell it, you can taste it, you can feel it. Beautiful. And y'all know I couldn't have any uh, fish without any little hush puppies, but that's a whole another story. But I wanted you all to see how beautiful this beer battered fish had cooked up. It's still a little hot here. But I wanted to take a piece off and let you just see. You see, and let this camera adjust when it gets ready. But yeah, you see how beautiful that fish is? Just look at the texture. Look at that, how flaky. Flaky? I'm sorry, flaky that fish is. You see how beautiful it is. Gorgeous. So that's our beer battered fish and now we're ready to eat. So we finished up our little fish here. Now this kitchen smelling good. I usually cook my fish outside but uh, it was a um, wasp trying to get at me earlier and this morning. So I exed that uh, plan right there and I came on in this kitchen and cooked this fish but it's a crunchy really good fish so just get yourself a little bit of beer and go on and put it in that batter and make this fish up for yourself so you can have as happy a day as I am having. I appreciate you all joining me and you know I do and I'm asking you all just invite a friend on over to subscribe to us here so we can all just be having this great time in this kitchen. So I'm gonna go on now and enjoy my fish, beer batter fish, boozy fish. Just love it. 
I'm going to go on and enjoy it as well as I've enjoyed you all. Okay? Thank you again for joining me in this booze and food kitchen. Huh? Mmm. Oh, oh, oh. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm.